Yo guys, welcome back to the video. And today's video, we're talking about um, Invest91P, which is now a low percent chance of formation. The reason why it is a low percent chance of formation right now is because, one, it's, um, it's definitely 100% not looking good right now. Um, and plus, it there's no impacts to the Bahamas. So, guys, if you like my videos, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. But anyway, let's get into this. So, anyway, um, it's a tropical tidbit. So I'm going to show you. This is only going to be five minute video, I guess. There'll be another reaction tomorrow. So, stay tuned for that. But as you can see, Invest 91P is absolutely not looking good right now. It's because of that um, Honga Tonga volcano that, you, that erupted, as you guys saw. Um, with the GFS with 91P, they don't really want this system to form anymore. So, uh, as you can see, it doesn't really form nearly near um, the coast of Australia or anywhere near that. So, I'm going to show you the HBRF. They think it. They think it's still going to form. Um, then maybe hit Fiji as. A 1,003 millibar storm. Then... Going to hit those other islands where Cyclone Ruby hit. And Seth, so... Anyway, this is going to be a quick video. As there's nothing really active in the world, guys... Uh, 91p looked so good earlier on today when I last looked and now look at it the convection is completely waned which means that it doesn't really look like it's going to be forming anything and I think Curtis will be up they, I think Curtis will be uploading a video or um, an animation to, later on, I think. Um, let me just ask him, guys, one sec. Yeah, guys, I uh, just ask him, and he's now he's, he's going to do Hyper Earth. So, you know, links will be in the description for his um, channel. Go and subscribe to him. He's actually really good. No joke. He's actually really good. He's getting more views than me, but that's not about the views, even though I've got 41 subscribers now. Um, that, that means a lot to me. Thank you guys for getting me to 41. I need to 42 to beat my previous record. Now, please, subscribe to me. There'll be my 2020 and 2021 Hurricane animations will be coming out soon. As you already know, I collabed with someone who's called Joy Tracking. And he's not really that well at the minute. Um, as he's suffering with stuff, I'm not gonna say because it's personal, but um, as soon as soon as he made them, I'll let you know. Then I'll get Curtis to edit the music in them, and then I'll upload them, and boom, bam, easy. And then hopefully they should take off. So anyway, so this is this I'm talking about the landing now. So, we are going back into a moderate landing here again, as you can see here. It just keeps moving up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, like that. Um, my predictions, I think we are going to get a landing here, um, in 2022, this year. I think we will get it some over here, somewhere. It's not going to be as strong as 2020. Or as strong as 2020 
one, but in October it was like this, and now basically it's going down again. So basically, it had its peak here, where it got to a model at La Nina. So I'm going to show you the one plus two, and here it is. Um, they're saying it is borderline mod moderate La Nina right now. It had its peak November the 22nd, a few days after my birthday. Um, so, yeah, I'll show, I would show you Salad imagery, but boom. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. You know, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and have a reaction out tomorrow at 7, 7 o'clock GMT time, which will be... Um, uh, about 10 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, or 9, or, yeah, 10, 10 o'clock Pacific Standard Time, and then, um, I don't know what time that will be in Australia, but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you like, comment, subscribe, share, see you in the next video, peace, and have a great day.